So the deal with energy is it's not where you want it to be, and you have to move it around. And we're still moving it around in a way that Edison and Tesla would have understood 100 years ago. But we all have these gadgets. I'm looking for my cell phone. Pretend I'm holding a cell phone. We're in a wireless world, and we can do the same thing for power. And this is a prize that demonstrates wireless power beaming, which is a technology that is available now, but nobody knows it because nobody's seen it, and you don't believe it till you actually see it. So the deal here is fly a platform about 500 feet with bright lights on it and has cameras on it. People in the world can see what the platform sees. It has to be up for a week. Look, ma, no wires. And then it has to go up for another week, up to about 20,000 feet, so it could cover a whole city and provide broadband, provide surveillance, provide relays so you have supercell networks for the world as an initial step. But in the long run, once people know you can do power beaming, you can relay power from one continent to another, and the ultimate thing is bring clean, carbon-free power from space to people on the Earth, most of whom live in cities. Thank you. Thank you, Greg.